States that endorsed us, and all the endorsers from all across the country, my colleagues in the Senate, in the House, and from the Vice Presidency, from the Vice Presidency, from the Vice Presidency. We're going to walk out of here with uh, our share of delegates. We don't know exactly what it is yet, but we feel good about where we are. And look, so, so it's on to New Hampshire. Just tonight, but throughout this campaign, this is a, this. Thank you. This, this isn't just another election. This is well beyond this, our party. This is about uh, ending an era of, uh, well, ending an era, God willing. And character is on the ballot. That's what this is. We've got to rebuild the backbone of this country. The working class, the middle class, they've been getting laid out badly by this administration. The middle class is being hurt very badly. But look, you know what? We have uh, we have to unify. Well, everybody understands that that CEOs and uh, Wall Street bankers didn't build America. Ordinary, hardworking people led by unions build America. We need a president who's not only ready to fight but is also ready to heal this country. We can't hold grudges. We've got to be able to go out and unify the country because the president is supposed to heal as well as fight. And that's exactly what I plan on doing. Supposed to heal. We plan on doing. All of us in this hall plan on doing. Supposed to heal. Uh, go all over this country. Every part of the Democratic Party. Supposed to heal. Men, women, gay, straight, everyone. Supposed to heal. Black, brown, a whole universe of people out there. Supposed to heal. Everybody knows who Donald Trump is. I'm coming for you. And folks, we got to let them know who we are. And maybe most importantly of all. Truth over lies. I look forward to locking you all up in the coming years. You have the courage to speak the truth, to do what is right, and to fight for what you believe and keep doing it. Damn bird.